minutes to my camera. I'm trying to hold it a little steady, but I do have a Jeep. So she's a little bit bumpier than some people's cars. Also, I live up in the mountains in the Poconos. So it's not like we have the absolute smoothest roads to drive around here. You might see the mountains and the horizon there. Kind of hard to see them. I'm on the freeway now. I'm going to the feed store. Need to get some feed for my critters. Then I will be driving home and I will probably flip the camera and have a little chat. I've been wanting to do this. I do need to get a better camera mount for my dashboard. This camera mount will not hold my camera in landscape mode. Oh, I love this. Watch for changing conditions. Winter weather. No, really? I couldn't tell by all the snow on the ground. Thank you for letting, oops. Thank you for letting me know. I just flashed my brights and I meant to do my windshield wiper. Whoopsie. I am getting off the freeway and I am going to Main Street. Netflix chose five or six cities in the US to do holiday light displays. And it turns out that my town is one of them. How freaking weird and random is that? So Netflix chose our town to do a light display. I was just gonna go to the feed store, but I wanna see if the lights are on right now. It gets dark early, so they might be on. I don't know, maybe they're always on, I don't know. I haven't seen them yet, but I've had friends post pictures. This is the town of Stroudsburg, I actually live in, um, in a little town next to it, but this is Stroudsburg, Pennsylvania. I'm going to go the back way. Oh my God, do you see how bumpy these roads are? I'm not kidding, it's insanity. This is not city roads, people. I don't live in a city. I live in a rural area. Very cute though, cute houses, cute places. Man, I wish I had some water in my car. I have the driest throat because my heater is blowing right on me right now. There's a really cool restaurant right up here on my left. You can't see it, but it's called Little Angels Cafe. If you ever come to Stroudsburg, Pennsylvania, Angels, Little Angels Cafe is so cool. It's a little nativity scene at the church on the corner of Main Street. Kind of stuck at this light. This is a little bit of a long light. This is the Main Street light from 611. And don't be coming trying to find where I live either because I can show you Stroudsburg and Main Street, but holy cats, country roads everywhere, trying to narrow down where I live and where I came from ain't gonna happen. And I'm probably gonna stop filming before I go too far close to my house and up my road. So we're up Main Street. The Netflix lights are not on yet, unfortunately. They're, they would be right up in the middle of the road here. I see them all strung across, but they're not lit up, which is kind of a bummer. I was kind of hoping they would be. And so this is the Main Street of my town. It's very quaint. It's exactly the kind of thing people come here to see as far as what's the word I'm looking for. Quaint little tourist spots a lot of little boutiques and little stores. Coming up past this light, there's a red thing that says, here for the holidays. And then all these little signs are lit up. Oh, it's only this one block. Oh, this little cafe right on the right. Can you see right immediately on the right with the dark win windows? It's called The Cure. They have the most amazing food there. They have avocado toast. They have awesome food. I wish the Netflix lights would have been on. I am gonna drive back up here and film the Netflix display. Not much happens here. It's a very quiet little town. This is it, this was Main Street. I just drove you up Main Street. That was the entire thing. If you blinked, you probably missed it. Okay, so there's a little open sign on the right. That's Ready, Set, Run. That's our running store. And I'm about to turn into the feed store. So I'm going to pause my camera so I can turn in here. I'll be back. Yay! Oh my God, people are driving like crazy people right now. I have to go stop at Wawa. If you know what Wawa is, my East Coasters, comment below. There's a thing in Pennsylvania, you're either for Sheets or Wawa. I am for Wawa all the way. It's my post office on the right personal post office, the post office for our town. Right here on the right is Frazetta's Costumes, and here's some Christmas lights on a house. Pretty. 
pretty snow on the trees. Okay, these houses on the right, check these out. Those two houses, I don't know if the people are related or if they just started this years ago, like let's see who can do more decorations. FYI, it's 422, it's already getting dark. It is 35 degrees Fahrenheit here. I'm gonna flip the camera around. So I'm, back. so I'm driving, I'm out of town now. I'm headed more towards where I live, which is outside of town about 20 minutes. When I need to run errands, you know, some people just run into town and it's, they go for a quick drive. When I go into town, it's a project. I have to plan about an hour to go into town. There are grocery stores that are close to me and I got a giant Coke, I confess. And I'm going to Wawa and getting a ginormous coffee because this will be my third video I'm recording today. Actually third or fourth, third or fourth. I still have two on my computer and I'm gonna have five or six videos to edit over the next few days, which is insanity. Hopefully they won't take me too long to edit. The, the good thing about this Vlogmas is I'm getting faster and faster. Hold on, I'm gonna flip my camera again. Oh my God, my unicorn's head is in the way. Hold on, there we go. I have, a, I have an angry unicorn. It's like kind of pretty driving through here. So as you can tell, like now I'm just getting into trees, 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 snow covered trees. So when I need to go into town, I have to plan about an hour out of my day. Most of the stores are 20 to 30 minutes away, depending on where I'm going. The feed store is about 20 minutes one way. Because driving through this area is really nice. And then when we come back into like stores and boring and nothing to look at again. You kind of drive through these little country roads where there's just like a lot of trees and a lot of nothing. And there's random things around, but there's not a lot. And then you come into a little tiny area where there's this right here, where there's just a couple of little stores. It's a chiropractor, there's a collision place, there's a little auto parts store. Okay, so then that was it big shopping area there and now we're back to trees 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 and snow which is why I like living here trees snow hilly I don't know why I stopped recording it's pretty cool having such a unique car everywhere I go in this town because it literally I'm the only purple Jeep so think about it if I flip somebody off or I drive angry or I'm a jerk to somebody they know it's, I probably uh, would be known as purple Jeep bitch to those people. It's that purple Jeep bitch. My camera's like not focusing on me at all. It's being really weird. It's probably a good thing I'm not in focus. I probably look better this way. You can see out my back windows. So you can see like the trees and the snow and stuff. But yeah, my camera doesn't want to focus on me, which is fine by me. If I can just walk around being out of focus, I look a lot, like, a lot younger and my skin looks better. So. Let's do that, shall we? I'm at Wawa and my space is available. I have a space at Wawa that I'm obsessed with. It's like my favorite parking place because <laughs> I have a Jeep and it's really easy to turn it in and pull out without worrying about cars around me. Gonna go get my coffee, bye. I'm filming because I wanna see if you can see this waterfall that I drive by. I'm a sucker for a waterfall and to live where I just drive by waterfalls on my drive home. It's just the coolest thing. I love it when it snows here. I especially love it when it snows and there's snow on the trees and the road is so clear. Look how clear this road is. Nobody's behind me. I'm going to go really slow. It's hard to see it. There's a waterfall. I don't know if you can see it. It's There it is. Waterfall. So there's the one waterfall and there's a little creek. You hear my Jeep because I'm starting to go up now. We're doing elevation. From here all the way to my house, it's uphill. It's going up, up, up. My house isn't a really, it's not a super high elevation, but we're I think 1,076 feet. And where I was in town, 
I jokingly call it the valley, but another little bridge. This is about 10 minutes of driving on roads like this now to get to my house, but I thought I'd throw this in because it's really pretty, especially this time of night and with the snow on the trees and everywhere. I don't know how I could ever, I don't think I could ever go back to living in a city. So you'll see this, see up ahead, the trees kind of go up. It's hard to see it. When I come down the mountain, I'll film the next time. I'll film coming down so you can see kind of where I am. It's really neat too, on the other side of where may, um, where the main road goes through between the mountains, where I just was, down where I just was by Wawa. There's actually a ski place that's right across from my mountain. And when you come down my road, they were making snow yesterday at the top of the mountain across from ours. As I drive down, it's really neat at night because you see all the lights on the ski slope. video game character. I couldn't name her Tiny Tina because she's not pink. And yes, this is how far out I live and all these roads out here and you won't see a lot of houses. It's very cool. Somebody went off the road there. Oh yeah, this is slippery. I don't have my four-wheel drive right now. Getting a little slippery, but I'm almost to my house. I think I'm in a four-wheel driver. There we go. She's in four-wheel drive now. We're okay. All right. But yeah, I really do live in my own little world up here. If you like that kind of thing, you want to follow and subscribe to me because I'm going to do a lot filming in my area and around the Poconos and all of my pla favorite places out here that, who knows, you might want to come check out sometime and visit. It is a beautiful place. We need to get this. Miss Rona needs to wrap it up and get that out of here so that... We can go back to normal life and people can travel and things. Pulling up to my house soon. See ya.